Hey guys, today I'm going to be opening a Kaijudo Vortex booster box. Uh, I believe it's the only box besides Dragon Strike that I haven't opened. Uh, won't be doing that one because uh, A, it's super expensive, and B, I haven't seen one online in a while. So, here's the back Face the Revolution. This was the last printed set of Kaijudo before they canceled the game. Eye of the Storm was released as a, um, I think it was in PDF format. So if you were able to find someone who would print the cards for you, you could have the whole set. I still have not done that. Um, I'm not really going to. I'm just going to kind of just admire the cards. Um, just not interested in spending the money for that. We have our little pamphlet here to booster draft. Our card was not a very good one. Not a good box topper. Hydrist, the Oathbound, uh, not, a very, not a very good card. So... Uh, how about we just pull the packs out? And... Get it all set up. <coughs> Alright, let's get to uh, opening some packs here. Code cards. Remember when I used to use those? Leafwing Totem, Raptor Ace Falco, Metroplex Scout, Regents Attendant, Lumbering Coliseum, Cloud Grappler, Ecor Spider, Ardu Cloud Striker, Justice Archon, Gargle Vision, Katarl the Gladiator, Ancestor Bear, Skyforce uh, Adjuant, and Gregoria's Guile. Some of these cards I remember going to the Vortex Draft and uh, getting some of these. Now, in the final draft, I absolutely did awful. Uh, all the other drafts and other events, I had always won. And then this one, I absolutely just did horrible. So, Prowling Chimera, Spark Drone, Jetpack Thug, Tide Gulper. Uh, Megaria's Trap Heap, I remember using this card. Boyd Seer, Sprite's Gift, Spy Tide, Decay, Lava Burst, Hollow Worm, Rite of Revival, Flaming Arrow Volley, and Wave Crest Crawler. Uh, in that draft, I just pulled awful, awful stuff. Um, ended up playing on the, on the defensive most of the time, and I was trying to run black, and... I think green, so darkness and nature, but uh, didn't work out very well. So we have Legionnaire Corpse, Ancient Keeper, Blaze Darter, Wave Skimmer, Ring Leader Radish, Aerial uh, Archivore, Vicious Coffer, Creeper Snare, Hydragon, Storm Strike Enforcer, Guitar of the Gladiator, Ignis, Zephyr Keeper, Lurking Orchid, and then the code card at the end. <laughs> I'd let you have the code if it'd do anything, but unfortunately you can't play the online game anymore, which I'm, I remember spending a lot of time playing it when I wasn't busy with uh, any classwork or wasn't with friends. So, Wave Skimmer, Megarius Trap Heap, Storm Diver, Cyber Savant, Trapdoor Tunneler, Spy Tide, Grim Spectre, Warren Shaman, Blade Rush Wyvern, Void Seer, uh, Tarvox, The Voracious, Lethal Lockbox, Lunar Boar, and Meteor Rider. Yeah, a lot of fun on the online game. I uh, wish I had recorded footage back then. Now that I, I look back, but you know, in, in all honesty, I figured this game would have lasted longer, so... Hydrobot Elite, Spark Drone, 
Sandstorm Prowler, Leafwing Totem, Spy Mission, Storm Strike Enforcer, Vicious Coffer, Jack the Hammer, Sunshock, uh, Malphagus the Tormentor, a Foil Rygar the Tank, Bronze Arm Fanatic, Abyssal Scavenger, and Sinister Scheme. Um, I remember Sinister Scheme getting some play just because Terror Pit wasn't in the set and uh, <clears throat> using that card. Aqua Swordsman, Sledgebot, I remember Sledgebot being used, Prowling Chimera, Aurora Scout, Runestone Goliath, Jack the Hammer, Rip Swirl, I remember this card being used, Phase Generator, Deteriorate, Duke Durian, Wildfire Valkyrie, Emperor Palata, Bolt Hawk, Ammo Train, and then Code Card. I, get, I keep forgetting to pull those out and setting them to the side, but uh, <coughs> looking back at some of these cards makes me kind of remember the, the draft again. And uh, if I get another box, I'm going to have to draft again. Dreamfish, Superior Citadel Militia, Smoldering Brute, Colossal Avenger, Val Cave Worm, Duke Durian, Artillery Dragon, Grim Spectre, Time Tethers, Solstice Chanter, Ritual of Challenge, Teleportation Equation, I don't remember that card being used, Bloated Gatekeeper, and Grove Protector. It's pretty cool. I forgot that these packs were also 14 cards a pack. Um, definitely a lot of value in these packs. So, Pesky Pineapple, Mischievous Fire Chick, Gloom Wraith, Prelate of Wind, Ringleader Radish, Radiant Sphere, Hypnobot, Savage Spawn, Ashen Tribute, Sunshock, Citadel Judge, Vile Piercer, Wave Keeper, and Mighty Stomp. Wraith Hound, Scroll Orb, Blaze Darter, Cloaked Saboteur, Legionnaire Corpse, Gullet Ghost, Warren Shaman, Battering Monolith, Dark Bolt, Master Trader Sephilia, Chaco Lunatic Chim. Good lord, I remember pulling this card. <laughs> Riot Sprite, Deep Currents Drifter, and Embolden. Oh. I was so disappointed when I pulled Jocko because everybody was pulling all this cool stuff and I pulled Jocko and I was like, ugh. I was like, this draft is just not going to turn out great for me. And in reality, it did not. Runestone Goliath, Scroll Orb, Gloom Wraith, Raptor Ace Valco, Metroplex Scout, Creeper Snare, Phase Generator, Gargle Vision, Gullet Ghost, Wave Force Seer, Foil Time Lost Phantom. Cool. Zephyr Keeper, Grove Protector, and Vile Piercer. Uh, I think I ended up trading for a Time Lost Phantom, because I did not pull it. I was just intrigued uh, by the card. Just because it's a, it's a really strange card. <laughs> so, I remember being uh, super excited and actually wanting that card. Chasm Gigabolver, Scroll Orb, Storm Diver, Aqua Swordsman, Laden Rush Wyvern, Batter Axe, Granite Titan, Optic Cell, Raging Firebrand, Tarvox, The Voracious, and what's there, what's there, what's there? Oh, sweet. Toronok the Void Shaper. Very nice. Vile Raptor, Daunting Presence, and Cranky Leviathan. That's a sweet card. Ugh. Fantastic. That is, uh, that's worth the box right there. Uh, just to let you know, I paid $19.99 in free shipping on this box. Somebody on eBay had them for real cheap. <coughs> so I bought it. Uh, they're usually like $30, I believe, or a little more. Runestone Goliath, Superior Citadel Militia, Cyber Savant, Trapdoor Tunneler, Sandstorm Prowler, Justice Archon, Savage Spawn, Spy Mission, Ardent Observer, Malphagus the Tormentor, Aeronaut Glurgle, <laughs> alright, Meteor Rider, Metroplex Operative, Bewildering Blast. 
when I was first playing the game, I also watched the show, and I wasn't actually a fan of Glurgal at the time. It wasn't until I actually quit playing the game after it had ended and everybody moved to a different game. Majority of them moved to Force of Will, which is kind of done here. Colossal Avenger, Agent of Lies, Aurora Scout, Dreamfish, Smoldering Brute, Radiant Sphere, Ardu Cloud Strider, Deteriorate, Lava Burst, Rip Swirl, Roganite the Obliterator, Slithering Phantasm, Empyrean Overseer, and Lunar Boar. But uh, as I was saying, like after the show and everything ended, I, I kind of appreciated Glurg a little more. I went back and reviewed a lot of his cards and just looked at them, and he's actually not too bad. Scroll Orb, Blaze Darter, Cloak Saboteur, Legionnaire Corpse, Pesky Pineapple, Warren Shaman, Battering Monolith, and a card backwards in there. <laughs> Radiant Sphere, Dark Bolt, Hypnovot, Runes of Fortune, Ancestor Bear, Slithering Phantasm, and Zephyr Keeper. Yeah, poor old Glurgal. He, uh, he didn't get enough play, I don't, I don't think. He actually wasn't too bad. <coughs> Everybody, I think, was focused on Tatsurian. Raptor Ace Valco, Metroplex Scout, Regent's Attendant, Lumbering Coliseum, Wraith Hound, Ecor Spider, Ardu Cloud Strider, Justice Archon, Gargle Vision, Gullet Ghost, Soul Reflection, Ammo Train, Wave Keeper, and Emperor Pallada. I just enjoyed when Bolshak made his appearances. I think he only had two cards in this game. But, uh, if I remember correctly, it was just two. But still, that was pretty neat to see Bolshak. Spark Drone, Jetpack Thug, Tide Golfer, Megarius Trap Heap, Leafling Totem, Spy Tide, Decay, Lava Burst, Cloud Grappler, Jarbala Hatchery, The Cronarch. Not bad. Not bad at all. Empyrean Overseer, Lethal Lockbox, and Daunting Presence. I definitely remember the Cronarch getting pulled, because I remember uh, one of the people I played against actually ran that card. <laughs> So, and he summoned it, so, Blaze Darter, Wave Skimmer, Ringleader Radish, Prowling Chimera, Creeper's Snare, Hydragon, Stormstrike Enforcer, Void Seer, Sprite's Gift, Salvation Reckoner, we have a Foil Field Marshal Cornucopia, Brave Chalotier, Aqua Infiltrator, and Ignis. So this is, if you want to do a Wild Veggie deck, use, uh, Field Marshal Cornucopia. I never did build one of those, and I kind of wish I had, because uh, I think this set and Quest did a really good job on uh, building up the, the card supply. So you have Tide Gulper, Raptor Ace Valco, Lumbery Coliseum, Intrepid Invader, Wave Skimmer, Creeper Snare, Lava Burst, uh, Adrian, or Ardent Observer, Grim Spectre, Warren Shaman, uh, Karstara the Warder, Mighty Stomp, Cranky Leviathan, and Bloated Gatekeeper. The corner on that one felt a little weird on the back. I guess it's just me. Hmm. I don't know. <coughs> so, uh, we're about almost 15 minutes into this. We're actually just 14. But I just wanted to, uh, wait, well, when I get done. Hydrobot Elite, Spark Drone, Sandstorm Prowler, Leafling Totem, Chasm Gigabulver, Lucius Coffer, Jack the Hammer, Sunshock, Rip Swirl, Batter Axe, Rothus the Destroyer, Galvanize, Fright of Revival, and Embolden. So if you guys did play this game by chance, you know, I'd like for you to leave stories in the comments. Um, I, I had a lot of fun with this game, and was really sad when it was cancelled. So we have Aqua Swordsman, Sledgebot, Prowling Chimera, Aurora Scout, Runestone Goliath, Phase Generator, Deteriorate, Duke Durian, Spy Mission, Stormstrike Enforcer, Wayforce Seer, Skyforce Adjutant, 
Marking Orchid and Teleportation Equation. I had, a lot of, I had a lot of fun with this game. It was the first game I had gotten many people to actually come and demo the game and get them to enjoy it. Superior Citadel Militia, Smoldering Brute, Colossal Avenger, Found Caveworm, Grim Spectre, Time Tethers, Solstice Chanter, Jack the Hammer, Rip Swirl, Perseus Dragon, Z Rune Master Zeer, it's Foil, Grove Protector, Gregoria's Guile, and Riot Sprite. But, and then just the game itself was a lot of fun. <clears throat> just an all-around good game, just a good product. And then they just had to take it away. <laughs> uh, Mistress Fire Chick, Gloom Wraith, Prelate of Wind, Ringleader Radish, Dreamfish, Savage Spawn, Ashen Tribute, Sunshock, Duke Durian, Artillery Dragon, Magalcax, Media, uh, Media Rider, Vi uh, Vile Piercer, Deep Currents Drifter. I'm not able to pronounce things at certain points. I don't know why. I see a few of them and then I'm just like, what is this? I just wish they would have let this game last a little bit longer. I think that would have been awesome. Scroll Orb, Storm Diver, Aqua Swordsman, Legionnaire Corpse, Ancient Keeper, Granite Titan, Optic Cell, Raging Firebrand, Aerial Archivore, Vicious Coffer, Tusk Nautiloid, Wave Press Crawler, Flaming Arrow Volley, and Bile Raptor. Over halfway done on the box. So, not too bad. Had a few interesting pulls. Superior Citadel Militia, Cyber's Font, Trapdoor Tunneler, Sandstorm Prowler, Chasm Gigabulver, Savage Spawn, Spy Mission, Ardent Observer, Blade Rush Wyvern, Batter Axe, Shred Main, Sinister Scheme, Lunar Boar, and Temple Lantern. I don't know if I pulled Temple Lantern yet. I can't recall that I have. We have Agent of Lies, Aurora Scout, Dreamfish, Smoldering Brute, Runestone Goliath, Ardu Cloud Strider, Deteriorate, Lava Burst, Rip Swirl, Justice Archon, uh, Kuth the Dervish, Lava Racer, that got used quite a bit, uh, Metroplex Operative, and Bewildering Blast. <clears throat> so I'm going to push those that way, that way I have some space to put down the cards. Colossal Avenger, Intrepid Invader, Mistress Fire Chick, Primal Chimera, Aqua Swordsman, Jack the Hammer, Sprite's Gift, Ardent Observer, Spy Mission, Battering Monolith, Rothus the Destroyer, Bloated Gatekeeper, Flaming Arrow Volley, and Teleportation Equation. It's so weird to see Rothus and not think the Traveler. But then again, it's Kaijudo, not Duel Masters, so. <laughs> Uh, Smoldering Brute, Horned Chameleon, Wave Skimmer, Megarius Trap Heat, Hydrobot Elite, Ecor Spider, Solstice Chanter, Time Tethers, Radiant Sphere, Vicious Coffer, Nether Tactician, Lava Racer, Lurking Orchid, and Wave Keeper. like another super rare card. <laughs> Foul Caveworm, Cyber Savant, Sledgebot, Legionnaire Corpse, Prelate of Wind, Hydrogon, Granite Titan, Justice Archon, Hypnobot, Ashen Tribute, Over Shields, Slithering Phantasm, Temple Lantern, and Metroplex Operative. Here we go. So we have Pesky Pineapple, Mistress Fire Chick, Intrepid Invader, Cloak Saboteur, Colossal Avenger, Dark Bolt, Time Tethers, Ashen Tribute, Radiant Sphere, 
<laughs> Radiant Blinder Horn. Good God, I forgot about this card. Hydras the Oathbound, which we pulled in the box. Emperor Palata, Sin uh, Sinister Scheme, and Galvanize. Yeah, he was our box topper. I like how our store was actually fair on like whoever won the tournament would get the box topper. So, Foul Cave Worm, Horned Chameleon, Hydra Body Elite, Sledgebot, Gloom Wraith, Grim Spectre, Artillery Dragon, Optic Cell, Sunshock, Solstice Chanter, Arachnamech, Gregorio's Guile, Embolden, and Ammo Train. So we hadn't seen uh, that mech one, so that's good. We have Regent's Attendant, Lumbering Coliseum, Jetpack Thug, Tide Gulper, Prelate of Wind, Warren Shaman, Ecor Spider, Raging Firebrand, uh, Aerial Archivore, Hypnobot, Cannonade Dragon, Ancestor Bear, Bolt Hawk, and Abyssal Scavenger. There were quite a few good cards in this set. I enjoyed this one. I think Quest for Gauntlet was probably my favorite, though, in all honesty. Storm Diver, Spark Drone, Wraith Hound, Ringleader Radish, Sandstorm Prowler, Cloud Grappler, Duke Durian, Spy Tide, Batter Axe, Hydragon, Earthbound Giant, Rider Revival, Wave Crest Crawler, and Fury Wing Trooper. This got used quite a bit. <coughs> if you were a player of Kaijudo, let me know what your favorite set was. And uh, if you could, let me know why. Um, just very curious. Ancient Keeper, Chasm Gigabulver, Cloak Saboteur, Trapdoor Tunneler, Granite Titan, Void Seer, Decay, Storm Strike Enforcer, Blade Rush Wyvern, Sedis the Augur, Rolled Waker, Omgoth, Triple Breaker. Woo! It's a crazy card. Skyforce Adjutant, Mighty Stomp, and Bronze Arm Fanatic. 13,000. Golly, and a 7 cost. Goodness gracious. I'd hate to have to go against that. Luckily, I didn't have to play against that in the draft, because nobody drafted it. <laughs> uh, Superior Citadel Militia, Dreamfish, Pesky Pineapple, Aurora Scout, Decay, Battering Monolith, Optic Cell, Aerial Archivore, Dark Bolt, Real Vortex, we have a Foil McTalk Life Spark Guide, Deep Currents Drifter, Brave Chalotier, and Riot Sprite. I think uh, more than one person had actually pulled Muktok in uh, their packs. So I remember pulling it, and then I remember somebody else as well. Metroplex Scout, Regent's Attendant, Agent of Lies, Leafwing Totem, Blaze Darter, Deteriorate, Raging Firebrand, Cloud Grappler, Gargle Vision, Savage Spawn, Roganite the Obliterator, Dawning Presence, Ignis, and Bewildering Blast. One more pack left. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to talk any of the other packs with this one, because I just don't foresee any kind of foil in this. So, Okay. Agent Keeper, Agent of Lies, Jetpack Thug, Horned Chameleon, Wraith Hound, Phase Generator, Call It Ghost, Ardu Cloud Strider, Artillery Dragon, Sprite's Gift, uh, Karstara the Warder, Empyrean Overseer, Bile Raptor, and Aqua Infiltrator. Alright guys, I just opened a whole Kaijudo Vortex Booster Box. That's all for this one. I'll see you guys next time.